Hey everyone, thanks for clicking on this video. My name's Teddy, and today I thought I'd show you guys my process for my 2020 Meet the Artist. This year, I finally managed to complete it. I tried back 2018, didn't finish it. I tried it earlier this year, <laughs> didn't finish it. Though, the 2018 version, I can say that it was a software, and it was a so is, would you class that as software or hardware? A tablet not working, I'm not sure, I think, I think that would be hardware problem. <laughs> Ignoring that little tangent. Um, I did finish this year, and I am really pleased with the results. As you would have seen in the beginning of the video, I was pretty confident with the layout I wanted to go. Though, I did alter it slightly, but you'll be able to see that further down. Though, the part of adding items to their little bottom section, that's normally the, what in my, what's in my bag? I couldn't really think of what to put on, because, you know, can't go anywhere because of Rona. So, you don't, not really using a bag right now. So, I just uh, added in my plushies with my drawing setup as well. So, recently... As you would have noticed, we're not on an iPad. So, <laughs> God, I make no sense sometimes. And I'm not cutting any of this audio, so enjoy this raw audio. <laughs> um, I recently got a new Cubion tab. I got the Cubion H60P, and it arrived a day before I actually filmed what you're seeing now. It was really easy to set up, and I really enjoyed doing it. And with that, I also ended up paying for Clip Studio Paint, just the pro version. Even on special, there's no way I could have afforded the, um, the, the higher tier. But I really liked Clip Studio. It was a really interesting program to work with. Previously on my computer, I've only worked with Fire Alpaca and Medibang, which Technically, you could probably call those the same program, because they're made by the exact same company. But yeah, those were essentially the programs I was using before. So using Clip Studio wasn't really that much different to either of those. It was a new experience, yes, but it was really easy to learn. So my plushies. My lovely, lovely plushies that my nephew has kidnapped. <laughs> Currently in his bed, no longer in mine. It's so sad. I picked three to add to this. I wanted to find more, but I've misplaced half of them. So the three I chose for this video was my hippopotamus named Pamela, my panda who does have a name. I have no idea what it is though. And Bulbasaur, which was just Bulbasaur, <laughs> you know. The Pokemon. There were other ones I wanted to add to, like my octopus, and then what else do I have? Probably my turtle as well, but like I didn't know where they were, and I haven't taken photos of them, so I couldn't get accurate references. Though they are stuff you'd get at a museum, so it probably wouldn't have been hard for me just to do a quick Google search and be able to find them, but in the end I didn't do that probably should have but i'm not smart that way <laughs> so in the future i'll probably do a mixture what well, my goal is to do a mixture of both clip studio um speed paints and procreate speed paints and throwing in the occasional traditional because i do like i did like the process of the earlier traditional videos i did and I still have everything I need to do that. It's just I currently don't have anywhere to do traditional art. Unless I want to film it in my kitchen. But there are tiny children in my house. And I don't think that's a smart idea to do. <laughs> so hopefully I'll have the setup done by October. So then I have a cool plan for October. I'm not going to spoil it. But I'm might drop some sneak peeks down on either my Instagram or my Tumblr, which I'll leave a link to both of those in the description. So if you're interested, go check those out. 
I really don't know what else to talk about. So, you know what? I'm just gonna leave you guys with music for however long is left of this video after I've edited the audio. <laughs> I did say I wasn't gonna edit it. So, th there should be like, what, roughly 20 seconds left? So, I'll just say this. I have the next three videos pre-recorded. All I have to do is do the voiceovers. So I can guarantee that there will be videos coming next week. And I'll see you guys then. Toodaloos guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.